Radiology anatomy quiz. Four cases getting harder as we go. How many can you get right? First case, can you name the structure? This is a post-contrast CT of the thorax and we're looking at the mediastinum. Here we have the pulmonary trunk, ascending and descending aorta, making this the superior vena cava or SVC, making its way to the right atrium. Easy start. Now have a look at this MRI scan. Can you name the structure? Here we can see the abdominal aorta and this is one of its branches and it has a sort of seagull shape. This is classic for the celiac trunk. This comes off at T12 and usually divides into three. Here you have the beginnings of the common hepatic artery, whilst here we see the splenic artery and the third branch we don't see is the left gastric artery. For case three, we're heading up to the brain. Here we have an axial T2 sequence of an MRI brain. With T2, we can see the fluid is bright. We need to identify the central sulcus, which divides frontal and parietal lobes. For this, I like to find the superior frontal gyrus, the most medial gyrus within the frontal lobe. Follow this down, and this meets the precentral gyrus in an L shape, which is the site of the primary motor cortex. Posterior to this is the central sulcus. This one's a bit of a tricky one. Here we have a view of a cardiac CT. We can see the right coronary artery in a C shape, when the RCA is dominant, it divides at the bottom into the PDA and then the PLB, posterior lateral branch, which arches up. How many out of four did you get? Let me know in the comments below. 